sana daktari habari zenu na wasalimu kwa jina la Mwenyezi Mungu mmeuka salama Asante sana kwa fursa hii uh, nataka kuanza ku introduce my brothers uh, I guess atakuja mbele na ataongea to introduce her beautiful wife over here God is good all the time Sina mengi ya kusema tumefurahia kuja kwenu Asante I have my lovely wife here Mampenda sana Wacha aje ya ongele na mwaja Tashukuna Na wasalimu wata mdamu Kwa mazina naita mere mpe mtu Mefurai kwa sababu mmekuja kukana Sise wakati mungumu Mkwe na hui upendo na mwanyesha na mdine kia Thank you very much. This is my second born brother. I'm um, the next after him. Then my beautiful sister is also here. I think she has a word. God is good. And all the time. God is good and that's Santiko Kudu. She's called Bilian Nanduko. I think she forgot to say her name, but uh, let me also bring forward my younger sister, our last born, who has been very close to my father. God is good. So this is the beautiful family of Henry Charles Mkundi. And uh, we appreciate all of you, you know, a lot of sacrifice that you guys have done to be here today. You could be doing very important things out there, but uh, you spend sleepless nights, you actually spend a lot of money to come over here. We really appreciate that. I would like to take you through a small biography of who my father was. And uh, one thing for sure is that uh, if you've never met a, a best friend is this man sleeping over here. He had very beautiful friends from all types. The low income earners, the middle income earners, and the very expensive people you know around. This man was born in 31st of 1960, in December. His full name is uh, Henry Charles Onkundi Noah, and he has very good family members who are his brothers and sisters. Uh, I can name them very quickly. That is Karen, who is the firstborn. Uh, Roda, Abisiba. Uh, we have Kefa, who is the brother. We have also Ezekiel and Jane, who is their lastborn. He was born in Bomachoge, uh, Rio Kindo. Now, our father valued education too much to the point that uh, when I requested that I transfer because I studied too far in Kakamega County, I come to Nairobi because uh, there is a university satellite in Nairobi. He actually refused and told me that I should focus on my own studies and uh, make my future. So he never even wanted me to transfer and come very close to him during this illness period that uh, he had. So he was a clerk, in which uh, he went on and became a senior clerk. Uh, our family that I've said over here, he was also a stout Christian. We were actually baptized together at KPCU Church, where we, we go together as a family. He started his career at uh, Ministry of Lands, and uh, he proceeded to National Youth Service, where he also served as a senior clerk. And, uh, I think that's why those guys are here with us today and we really appreciate, you know, we can't appreciate more than what we've done. Uh, my father also, when in his late 20s is when he was diagnosed with diabetes, he, he later developed blood pressure. Of course, Dr. Terry over here has told you that handling a patient, uh, we have seen it all. All of these people behind me over here have seen it all. Uh, personally, what is going through my mind right now are the moments, the, the few moments that we had with this man. And uh, seeing it all is the moment when we actually were taking him to a place like the toilet, you know. 